Okay, well, welcome to 44 Sherwood Trail in Breckenridge. So this is a great property for two reasons. First of all, great location in between Frisco and Breckenridge. Convenient location, excellent location for all parties. Very desirable, definitely for buyers and for sellers. But the active listings here, you know, I uh, took a snapshot. Within a mile of our property, we have 15 pending sales. We have 62 total um, between solds, active, and pendings, and 25 active, which says basically that we have approximately a 45-day market. Uh, but if you look into the active listings here, they're 825 to 875. Some of these are only half ab, which is a partial remodel. They're all around 2,600 square feet, which is our property, 2,600 square feet. Uh, they're 46 days on market, so exactly what I'm, I'm talking about here as far as averages. Um, your pending listings, as you see here, the price is 926 uh, living area square feet, you know, just below 2500 You're built 2001. So some of these have been remodeled, some of these are newer, some of these are um, half half, which is a half a rehab. And then of course your sold listings, which go back six months, uh, average price 809 so uh, that shows a slower market. Now we are coming into a very hot market. This year was, uh, well, incredible for the area. Living area square feet right around ours, which is 2,600 square feet, year built 97. We're of course going to be a remodel, so it'll be almost brand new and days on market 89. So the median of the comparables is 864. Uh, average comparable listings, 869. Uh, adjusted price average, 869. High is 1.2. So I believe the price of this property should be listed at 899. I think that we could have a valuation as high as 999 with just the remodel and making it a four bedroom, four bath uh, with included is an ADU, an accessory dwelling unit, which is a one bedroom, one bath above the garage. Okay. So real quick here, we have, here's a couple actives, 869, 825, both, this is a 3-2 and a 4-2. One's built in 83, one's built in 2002. Okay. So lesser. Here's an 875 and 724. One's active three bedroom two bath built in 82 that's active for 875 this one's pending 724,000 it's a four bedroom three bath built in 72 um, 2400 square feet so a little bit lesser definitely doesn't have that ADU the accessory dwelling unit which makes ours um, definitely more appealing to a buyer because you can receive about 950 on rent for that one bedroom one bath in this area which would absorb about a about two hundred thousand in your in your uh, mortgage mortgage band. These are two pending seven ninety nine and eight twenty five. Um, as you can see here, they're both right around the same size twenty eight hundred and twenty two hundred nineteen ninety five and nineteen eighty six looks like. Here's uh, two more pendings nine seventy five and nine thirty nine. Uh, both these are really small though point one three acre point one acre a four bedroom four bath and a three bedroom two bath. But this is brand new. This one's attached, has no room or space. Ours, of course, has lots of space, nice big lot, top of the hill, very desirable. Here's two more pendings, 1.2 and 995. Three bedroom, three bath, and a three bedroom, two bath. Both brand new though, right around the same size. And then here you go, Here's uh, these are solds, 770, 754, right around the same size, 2300 and 2900 square feet. Uh, one's a little dated, a little lesser of a, a location. Here you go, Salt View Circle. This one's older, uh, built in 2007, but a little dated, a uh, little basic, but sold for 730. This one, 860, three bedroom, three bath, and a four bedroom, three bath. Uh, right around the same square footage there again. And then here you go, this one sold for 887. That one's 903, four bedroom, three bath, three bedroom, two bath, right around the same size there again. So our listing price between 724 and 1.2. Some of these, like I said, haven't been remodeled or are dated. Ours will be there again, almost brand new, and have an accessory dwelling unit above the garage, which can be used as a rental or for like a mother-in-law apartment, okay? Some of them are a lot smaller too. We have a four bedroom, four bath. A lot of them are three twos, three threes, et cetera. Days on market, as you can see here, uh, you know, 50 all the way up to 320. Uh, it just depends on how you list it too. The big key is, is to list um, where it'll sell fast. We believe that price point, as you can see here, is right around uh, 850. 850 to 900,000 is your price point. 
You sell for 879 to 859. We have a valuation of say 900,000 conservatively. Uh, here you go. Averages again, active 856. That's for your half abs. That's for your um, older, smaller. These are three two, four two, three two. We're a four four with an ADU. There again. Uh, here you go. Your status on the pendings. This is the most recent stuff. Average is 926. Stays on market 36 days on market. That's very appealing, right, to us as investors. Status sold 809 is your sales price. DOM is 89. Your average square foot is 2600. This includes your older product, though. You have to understand older product in there. Um, there again, your CMA reports, your professional stuff. So when you review all of this, which is in your package, what you'll come up with is this property's worth uh, 900,000. Pretty solid, 900K. It'll sell quickly at 879, 859, 879 within 30 days to 45 days or less. We plan on marketing it heavy getting it built out and then marketing it for a big open house and selling it or having offers multiple or at least one first open house and then closing on that deal closing on that deal uh, for right around 850 to 870 uh, which is very appealing all the way around get in get out again having a rental unit on your property huge okay so here are CMA report active properties Highest price, 875. Average, 856. Uh, here again, pending. Our average is 926, right? 926. So good there. Again, highest price, 903. Average, 809. Okay, 809. Average DOM, 89. That's what again. Your older properties uh, are inclusive. So your cumulative analysis here, lowest price, 724. We're going to be all in this thing for 630, so no matter what, we're making money. Uh, even if we were competing against the distressed, um, you know, dated properties that need work, our average price, 869. This is our sale right here, 869. That's where I think where we're at. I think that we're 30 to 45 days on market or less. Um, I think actually we'll go into contract first week, uh, but they usually call that anywhere from 15 to 30 days. So there you go. Please review. If you have any questions, give me a call. Uh, but again, 900,000 valuation and a solid sale right around 850 to 870. Hope you've enjoyed this and we'll talk to you soon.